This video is sponsored by Noragon, the commercial vehicle data experts. Visit noragon.com to learn more. At a recent event in Birmingham, Alabama, we got to go inside the cab of the Shell Starship, take it around a test track, and see what it has to offer. The Starship is a concept truck that Shell has built with the intention of showing what kind of fuel efficiency is possible with currently available trucking technology. This is the third version of the Starship that has been built, and each one has gone on a cross-country run where its performance was measured and its efficiency was reported. For the Starship 3.0, the biggest difference is the switch in fuel between diesel and natural gas. The truck is now powered by the Cummins X15N natural gas engine, and it used this engine in last year's demonstration run in California. The first thing you notice is the spacious cab. There's a lot of room here. The second thing you'll probably notice as you settle behind the wheel is that the mirrors have been replaced by cameras. These are mirror eye cameras, which replace the mirrors to increase aerodynamics and fuel efficiency and reduce blind spots. Behind the wheel, drivers say there's not a huge difference between the uh, feel of a diesel and natural gas truck, but it's those fueling stations you'll need to watch out for because, as you might expect, they're not as plentiful as their diesel counterparts. Around the truck, Shell made sure to use currently available technology to maximize efficiency, including low rolling resistance tires and a low viscosity natural gas engine oil, among other things. At the event, I spoke with Heather Duffy, Global Communications Manager for Shell Commercial Road Transport about the goals behind the Starship and about its performance. So we're on version 3.0 of the Starship. We, uh, we had 1.0 and 2.0, which were diesel. Uh, we decided to switch to a natural gas engine just because uh, of the readily available um, uh, infrastructure for natural gas, but also the new Cummins X15N engine, which is their new big bore 15 liter uh, engine that's got the same torque and towing capacity that you would get from a diesel. Uh, we ran a test run last year about 840 miles in California uh, and we're able to see the, the benefits of the natural gas, uh, especially running renewable natural gas. It was, a, it was a big reduction in carbon footprint for the truck but also um, in fuel economy and, uh, and uh, freight time efficiency is the way we judge the, um, the performance of the truck. Right, so uh, freight time efficiency is not just about uh, fuel mileage, but it's also about being fully loaded while you're running your truck. Um, one of the biggest things that, that we can do to help save carbon emissions in the transport industry is to run fully loaded. So, you know, when you're deadhead or, or LTL, it's not the same, right? Because you're not, you're not moving as much goods from one point to the other as could be possible. Um, so with the natural gas truck, we um, we switched to the Cummins engine and um, and saw some really great results. We got nine miles per gallon, uh, which is uh, which is a great benchmark for natural gas. Natural gas runs a little bit hotter, so you're not going to get the same uh, fuel economy numbers that you would get from a diesel, but you get a lot lower NOx emissions from that. Um, so it's a it's a it's kind of a win-win, right? The um, and the cost equivalent per gallon of a natural of natural gas is a lot lower than diesel. So there's, um, there's some pretty significant monetary savings there too. So is that part of the, uh, the goal behind this is to kind of serve as sort of a model for fleets about what's possible with natural yes. gas? So the Starship initiative as a whole was created to show fleets what's possible with readily available technology. We didn't want to do a, you know, a, a super truck or, or a test truck, if you will. We wanted to test out some different technologies that are available, such as our uh, our mirror eye um, cameras that, that, that are added to the truck to help with the aerodynamics. We, um, we also have uh, low rolling resistance tires. We run the uh, Shell um, NG Plus natural gas engine oil. Uh, that's one of our Rotella products that is specially formulated for natural gas engines. Um, on the one and two versions, we also ran our T6 uh, 5W30 um, engine oil, which is a synthetic engine oil that, that gives a pretty significant um, increase in fuel economy. And as we all know, the, the better fuel economy you can get, the, the more you can reduce your total cost of ownership, but also your, uh, your carbon output from, from your fleet. For even more trucking and equipment content, head over to the Fleet Equipment site at fleetequipmentmag.com. Thanks for watching and see you next time.